And it's interesting that 11 of the 12 worst places in the world to be a woman in terms of the rights you have uh, are Muslim countries. 11 of the worst 12 places in the world to be a woman are Muslim majority countries. And is that a coincidence? No, because as we go through these, we see what Islam teaches about women. But the Quran commands Muslims to beat rebellious wives into submission if they don't, um, if they don't get in line after you, you warn them or punish them in other ways. So let me go ahead and read the verse, and then we'll see how this plays out um, in the Hadith. Chapter 4, verse 34 of the Quran says, Men are in charge of women because Allah hath made the one of them to excel the other. So men are superior to women. And because they spend of their property for the support of women. So good women are obedient, guarding in secret that which Allah hath guarded. As for those from whom ye fear rebellion. Notice it doesn't say as for those who rebel. It says as for those from whom ye fear rebellion. All you have to do is say, hey, I'm worried about this wife doing something against me. As for those from whom ye fear rebellion, admonish them and banish them to beds apart and scourge them. Then, if they obey you, seek not a way against them. Lo, Allah is ever high, exalted, great. So if your wife gets out of line, um, some people say this is all one lump thing. You can, you can just pick whichever punishment you think uh, fits the crime. Uh, others have a little ordering to it. So it's first you warn them, then you banish them to beds apart. And finally, if they don't listen before that, then you scourge them. You beat them until they listen to you. Now, Sam, yeah. westernized Muslims, yes, a lot sir. of westernized Muslims, they don't like this verse. So what do they do? They try and, and, and Yusuf Ali's translation, uh, he even inserts the word lightly yeah. in parentheses there, which the is Quran, not, right? Yeah, yeah, he has to improve the Quran because you don't want people thinking they can just go beat their wives senseless here. Uh, so we have to say it's beating them lightly now what's the problem with that yeah. is that we have not only the quran we yeah. have the hadith as well we have remember uh majority of muslims follow not just the quran but the son of muhammad how he implemented the the quran right now here's an example of how muhammad implements the ruling of the quran this is from sad bukhari lest we be accused of quoting a weak hadith sad bukhari is considered the second most authentic book